Yeah. Get busy. Get busy. Everybody get get busy. I need y'all to report to the dance floor right this minute. Nelson. So today's video, I think you guys are going to appreciate. I think you guys are going to be super excited to hear from the boyfriend. And guess who we're starting with today? Chase, okay. Kennedy's boyfriend. <laughs> All right. Are you guys ready? Yes. Oh, are you sure? I'm ready. I don't know if Chase is. All right. I think about it. <laughs> Okay, I have written down a few questions to get to know Chase better. First of all, Chase, what is your last name? Last name is Haddock. Chase Haddock, okay, awesome. Kennedy, yeah. I'm going to ask him these questions, but I'm going to also ask you first, see if you know Chase very well. What? I know, I okay. threw that trick in. They, did, they didn't know that was gonna happen. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, so Kennedy, where did Chase grow up? Well, he grew up in Texas, but he's also lived in a lot of other places. But he lives right now, he's from Dallas, Texas. He's from Dallas, Texas. Is that true? Yeah, that's Did you true. get it right? Yes. Where else have you grown up at? So I was born in Los Angeles, California, then we moved to Connecticut, and then Texas right after that. So we're in San Antonio, Texas, but now in Dallas, Texas. I've been there. Oh, wow, awesome. Cool, Kate. <laughs> so nailed it, good job. Kennedy, how many siblings does he have? So he has no sisters, and he has he is the oldest of five boys. Five. What are their names? Ooh. Cameron, Brandon, Ryder, and Trevor. Oh. Nice. I'll throw that question back at you. What are Kennedy's <laughs> siblings names? <laughs> I think you might have done this one. But... You did this on my video. Yeah, all right, all right, see. let's see. We got Ledger, Beckham, Elsie, Paisley, Presley, Lily, Sadie, Navy, Luke. How many is that? You missed one little one. You missed one little one. Little basketball She's player. blonde, she's oh, sporty. Oh, wait, give me a second. She was with me on the roller coaster. Uh, Delaney. Yep. Yes, yes, yes. And the older one is just Kennedy, Cass, Bridger, Trey, Jamie. Yeah. He's, here's he a hint. She has a boyfriend that's gonna be next so, in this video. Germany, yeah. Germany, that's it. That's all of them. <laughs> good job. I know that's tricky. Sometimes I even no, like, you did good. start yelling <laughs> the wrong name at the wrong child all the time. I'm like, you know who you are. All right. Is it hard that Kennedy has so many siblings? Uh, no, it's definitely a little different. It's a lot of fun. Especially with the Disney World trip and everything. I got to like experience what it's like being around all of them all the time. Yes. And honestly, I thought I had a lot of fun. I feel like it's just a party all the time. Every day, no matter where, whether we're here or whether we're in Florida or wherever, it's always party, a good time. Definitely a party. So, on to the next question. How did you meet? How did we meet? How did you meet? Did you the first time? Yeah, wait, wait, do I answer or does he answer? Um, we can just have him answer this Perfect. time. Um, first time I moved into a new apartment complex and a group of friends were watching The Bachelor and mm. I went. And I sat next to this girl named Kennedy and talked to her for a little bit. She claims I was asking her dumb questions. He was. I had never seen The Bachelor before. <laughs> <laughs> he was trying to talk to me. Oh, okay, I see, I see. Right. <laughs> we just, yeah, we talked a little bit that day. And then, yeah, that was the yeah, first time. That's pretty much it. Awesome. That okay. was like a So long what long. did you think about her the first time that you met her or saw her? <laughs> she was really nervous to talk to me and I was like, wow, What? Like, no, that is not true. <laughs> She was like, her hair, like, I was not going. <laughs> she was. Yeah. Fun. It was okay. I was, <laughs> I was, I was flattered, so. And then. That's not how it went. It's fine. It's fine. I'll let him have it. But no, that's not how it went. <laughs> but, no, I thought she was really cool. I thought she was pretty. I thought she was really funny. And yeah. <laughs> Definitely awesome. Okay. Of course, Kim. You're pretty. I'm awesome. You're awesome. She's funny. Funny. Sometimes. I don't remember what other words you use. Sometimes. <laughs> You're funny all the time, Kim. I know I am. <laughs> she thinks she is anyway. <laughs> all right. So, how long have you been dating? We've been dating, so this Friday is two months, almost two months. Nice. We have a tradition where we go get sushi. Sushi? Every month, though, it's like our. You say anniversary, even though it's like only been a month. Your month anniversary. My month anniversary. And then we go on a drive and look at all the pictures from the past month and talk about our favorite memories. Oh, what a cute I tradition. Like I like that tradition. You guys can scoot your chairs a little closer if you would like. Because I sense that you would like to be sitting closer because you keep leaning in, but you know. Oh, okay. okay. All right, there you go. <laughs> 
Three words that would describe you yourself, Chase. What are three words myself? you would describe you? Yeah. Can I think of three words too? Yes, you think of three words too. Three words describe myself. I would say ambitious, kind, and motivated. Nice. Kennedy, three words to describe I, I would say all those, but I'd add cocky. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not exactly how I describe dad, but something about that's very attractive. What is up with that? I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of like him. Just confidence, you know? Let's just that's, say confidence. That's what I was going to say. I wouldn't really say he's cocky. He's very confident. Just cocky. Because I wouldn't say he was cocky at all. I spent a whole entire week with this boy and I didn't, did. I didn't think he was cocky. No red flags. Definitely confident, which is cool. <laughs> <laughs> confident is great. All right. Now, three words that you would use, Kennedy, to describe yourself. I would say a planner. Mm-hmm. Kind as well. Mm -hmm. Or I could change it to loving. And then also. What can I do? Um, I'd say hardworking too. Hardworking, okay, good. All right, what are three words you would use to describe Kennedy? Kennedy, I would say beautiful, thoughtful, <laughs> and strong. Strong. Strong! I like that word. Look at these muscles. <laughs> Both, you know, physically and figuratively, right? Yes. All right. This is a very important question. Are you ready? This is a very important question. A lot rides on this question. <laughs> a lot. Okay. How do you treat your mother? How do I treat my mom? For me, my mom's definitely the most important woman in my life. Perfect. So I definitely always always am showing constant gratitude and appreciation for my mom and everything that she does for me. And I think even on top of being my mom, I also view my mom as one of my best friends too. So every time I go home to visit, we always go on like a ton of dates. We always get lunch or go like go-karting or pickle or some other activity. And I definitely just always want my mom to know that I am really appreciative of everything that she's done to help me turn into the man that I am today. Awesome, I love that, was, that. that was one of the things I really loved about Chase, is like, dude, whenever you talk about his mom, he, like, you can tell like, she has a special place in his heart, and I really like that. Yes, talking. yes, because I honestly think, oh, it's so cute. I honestly think that how you view your mom, how you treat your mom, how you love your mom, has a lot to do with how you will treat your future wife. I think that has a lot to do with it. So, um, <laughs> on that note, how do you think you will treat Kennedy, or how do you treat Kennedy? How do you view that you treat Kennedy? How do I treat Kennedy? Mm -hmm. um, or how will you treat For me, I, my goal with dating Kennedy is I just wanted to do whatever it took to make sure that she felt like she was the most special girl in the world every time she was with me. And I want her to make sure she always feels great, happy, and very comfortable with me, with anything that's going on in her life so I can help her out. And I want to treat her like a queen and do everything I can to make her happy. He does a good job with that. Aw, good mm -hmm. job. Awesome, well that's it. That's all, is there anything else we need to know about you? Well, I know one thing that I think is really cool about you. First of all, you're really, really kind to all of the kids when we were, and there was a lot of patience, man. This this guy right here, he had to have a lot of patience. Oh my goodness. Beckham literally would like just come up and like kick him. In fact, the kids had a thing going that they were like, Beckham, if you behave or you do this thing, we'll let you kick Chase. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> there was one time too where Beckham like like wanted Chase to like carry him everywhere. And so Chase was carrying him on his shoulders and he farted on oh! Chase. I regret. I think that the whole you get permission to kick was actually Janie's boyfriend. They gave Beckham permission to kick Janie's boyfriend if he behaved. <laughs> I know, it's kind of funny. I think that if anyone, they were like, Chase can hold him or yes. they could like hold hands with Chase. Elsie yeah. was definitely trying to steal Chase away from me. Yes. Me and Elsie have our own handshake. Oh, yeah. oh dear. Yeah, okay. Chase is really good with languages and so he was like speaking Chinese to all the kids and they were talking mad crap on me. That's true. <laughs> In Chinese. In Chinese. All right. You guys are so cute. Your interview is. Oh, so cute. Wow. Good job. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> you guys are funny. Bye. All right. See ya. All right, guys. We are here with our second boyfriend. This is Journey and. Cameron, and we're gonna get to know Cameron a little bit better. Journey, what I didn't tell you is some of these questions I'm also gonna be asking you. Thanks. All right. Awesome. Okay, so first question. First of all, Cameron, what's your last name? Daly. K 
Cameron Daly, okay. So, Journey, where did Cameron grow up? Um, he grew up in Washington. In Washington, like the state of Washington? Yeah. Awesome, is that true, Cameron? Yeah. Is that where you grew up? Mm -hmm. Good job, Journey. All right, how many siblings does Cameron have? He has five siblings. Five siblings, is that true, Cameron? Yeah. All right, now this is a harder question. What are his siblings' names, Journey? So, um, you've got Cameron, Rose, Spencer, Joy. Did yeah. you get him right? Uh, you're missing one, Brooke. Oh, Brooke. All right, so the sibling thing, you just missed one, right? Yeah. That's okay, well, it's not okay. But let me ask Cameron an even harder question. Cam, how many siblings does Journey have? 18. Ooh, good class, yes, close. She has 15 siblings. She's one of 16, because we have 18 in our family, so it's probably confusing. Yeah. Yeah. How many of her siblings can you name? You'll get extra points if you name them all, but I don't know if you can name them all. Ready, go. Well, there's Kennedy, Cassidy, Bridger, Journey, Trey, Sadie, Lily, Elsie, Beckham, Pleasure, Janie, Navy, and there's one more, isn't there? I don't even know which one you missed. You were doing so fast. That was good. You know who he missed? Sadie and Lily. Sadie and Lily? Janie. No, he got Janie. He got Janie. <laughs> I'll have to watch it back. Oh. I'm not sure which one Presley. she is. Presley. Presley. Good job. Holy cow. Cam, that's a lot. Good job. I didn't expect you were going to get that many. Okay, so next question. Is it hard that Journey has so many siblings? No, not really, because I have like so many cousins, like a total of 30 cousins. Wow, so it's kind of like just being with your other family, huh? Mm -hmm. Awesome, well, I'm glad. Okay, so how did you two meet? Um, I met Journey at uh, the school that we're going to uh, for my day visit, and she was doing work up front. I specifically remember what she was wearing that day. Oh! <laughs> what was what was she wearing, Cam? She was wearing her white sweatshirt with red writing, with her brown cowboy boots, with her white cowboy hat. Nice. Her jeans. <laughs> Classic journey outfit right there. <laughs> okay, and next question is, what did you think about her when you saw her? Um, well, I wanted to get to know her more, and that she had like this personality that I needed to get to know, and like this feeling that I felt like she was the person for me. Really? Whoa! Journey, did you know that? That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. I know, I think that Camry told me once that she just had a light about her. Mm -hmm. Is that what he said? So true, Journey does have a cute little light about her. All right, so how long have you two been dating? Like five months, almost six. Mm -hmm. Yeah, five, six yeah. months? Awesome, okay, this is a little tricky question. First of all, Cam, can you name three words that would describe you? What are three words that you would use to describe you? Uh, loving, kind, and helpful. Nice, I believe those three words because Cam went with us on our trip and he was all of those things. And Journey, what are three words you would use to describe Cam? Um, patient. Very. Nice. Nice, true. And spiritual. Spiritual. Awesome. All right, Cam, name three words that you would say describe Journey. Funny, smart, outgoing. Outgoing, yeah. All right, Journey, what are three words you would use to describe you? Um, artistic, enthusiastic, hardworking. Hardworking, for sure. All right, Cam, this is an important question. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, this question is so important because you wanna know why. I think how you answer this question kind of says a lot about how you will treat Journey. Are you ready? Cameron, how do you treat your mom? With respect and uh, being helpful and kind and trying to help my siblings. Yeah, awesome. I feel like my mom's done a lot for me. She's uh, pushes me past my limit and basically helps me understand that I can do more than what I'm capable of doing. Yeah. Oh, she sounds like a great mom. All right, this is why I asked this question is because how you treat your mom, Cam, has sometimes has a lot to do with how you'll treat your girlfriend or someday, you know, far, far in the future, your future wife. So how do you think you treat Journey or how do you try to treat Journey? With respect and being nice and funny and trying to understand her as best as I can. Yeah, I love that. And how do you treat Cam, Journey? Um, with respect and always trying to make him feel like he's important. Awesome, all right. That is the end of this scary interview process. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, good job. What a cute little couple right there. Thanks, guys. You're
All right guys, that's the end of our Meet the Boyfriend video. Hopefully you learned a little bit about those handsome young men that are part of our daughter's lives. They sure are great kids and we wanted to let you guys get to know them a little bit better as we got to know them a lot better last week when we were on our trip. Thanks guys, have a great week. Mwah. Thank you.